Thank you very much, and certainly thank you, Chief. And let me just start off by thanking at the very, at the very top uh, the firefighters from Station 11. Yes. Let me thank you for hosting us here today. Really appreciate, appreciate what you do, appreciate your service, and it's just good to be with you today. Um, look, uh, I am standing here with a good representation from the Houston City Council. Uh, when you get this number, that means it's an important event. So you've got the chairman of the Public Safety Homeland Committee that's here today with Brenda Stardick. You've got uh, the council member, Carlos Cisneros, council member Michael Knox, Mike Knox, and then you have council member David Robinson. It is a strong representation. Give it up to the city council members as well for being here. Let me just start off by saying Lyondale Basel is one of the largest plastic chemical and refining companies in the world. Not just in the state, but in the world. They provide the basic building blocks that make thousands of products safer, stronger, more affordable, and more reliable. And Lyondale Basel's global operational headquarters are located where? Right here in the city of Houston. And the company has approximately 1,800 employees uh, in the city. So give it up to Lionel already. And I just feel that they are going from 1,800 employees to 3,600 employees in the next few years right here in the city. Hint, hint. Uh, under, the leadership, <laughs> under the leadership of Bob Patel, under the leadership of Bob Patel, the company and its employees make it a priority to continue to, uh, to, to the success of this city financially and through active participation. They are good corporate citizens who give back to the community, not just today, but on a frequent basis. This year and last year, Houston suffered some of the most dangerous and life-threatening severe weather conditions in our city's history. Our first responders worked overtime to help ensure the safety of our residents, and I want to thank them again for that. Thanks to the generosity of Lion Pazell and, and the Houston Firefighter Foundation of Houston, they uh, gave some rescue boats and trailers to use when called to duty. The boats and trailers have already been deployed to help with emergencies. I view this partnership as an indication of how much stronger Houston can be when the public and private sector work together. I want to thank Bob and Lionel Pazell for this donation to the Houston Fire Department of Rescue Team also want to, want to use this opportunity to thank the family members of our first responders who must take care of themselves while their loved ones are out helping others during emergencies. They are a vital link in our ability to adequately respond and, to appreci and we appreciate you lending them to us during these particular times. So again, let me thank Lion Ebersell. Bob, let me, let me thank you uh, for the generosity of this company. And without your support and the uh, support of others like you, uh, this city would not be the great city that it is today. So again, on behalf of 2.2 million Houstonians, thank you so very much. <laughs>